All right, well, as of now, though, Alabama expecting to get the brunt of Hurricane Sally. Paul Dudley drove to Mobile to see what kind of an impact they're feeling, and he joins us live with an update. Good evening, Paul. Hey, good evening, Karen. Yeah, uh, Hurricane Sally continues to move on shore here in coastal Alabama. There is hurricane force winds that are expected. There is, of course, that strong storm surge and flooding rain, all a concern for coastal Alabama. There's also a level of concern here in Mobile as parts of the city do flood. And of course, anytime you get an inundation of any type of rain, possibly 10 to 15 inches, that's going to have an impact on the drainage system. We're actually at the convention center here in Mobile, and I want to give you a look here at the Mobile River. Uh, as you can continue to see the wind here picking up a bit, uh, but the rain actually hasn't been as bad as expected just yet. I've been talking with fire officials here in Mobile uh, as well as rescue officials and say, they say they are on standby and prepared if needed to assist. They are fully staffed and uh, have all fire engines ready to go with four people on each truck. They've also got water rescue boats and high water vehicles too. I spoke with some people at McNally Park earlier today, getting a last view of the water before heading uh, inside. And you can see the wind there really pretty bad. Uh, here's what ha some of those folks had to say before heading inside. It just looks like the, on the forecast, it's just gonna kind of fizzle out. And I believe that's what's gonna happen. I know that's what's gonna happen. How are you feeling about uh, this rain and some of this storm surge? It's all right, it's not that bad. I've been through Frederick, so it was really bad. <laughs> How long have you lived in the area? All my life. Yeah. So where, where's your level of concern right now as you look at the forecast? I really don't have any concerns right now, unless down towards Dolphin Island. And they're probably yeah. pretty bad. Right here in Mobile, you're feeling all right? Yeah. And fire officials here in Mobile want to remind all residents to make sure they stay inside during this storm and also wait till the storm is completely over. Remember, this is a slow moving storm. You don't want a false sense of security, so they're asking people to stay inside during this event. That's the very latest live in Mobile. Throw it back to you guys.